Jamie, some second half performance there from the side. Uh, yeah, I think in the second half uh, we were really good. I think we dominated in large parts and probably a few of us, well most of us in there, probably a little bit frustrated that we didn't come away with three points. I bet the uh, changing room was uh, somewhere to be at half time. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't in there. Uh, but look, it was, it was a tough uh, tough first half with the win. Um, frustrating, we didn't, couldn't come in nil-nil, but yeah, we played like that second half throughout the rest of the season and, and we'll be okay. Obviously, you came on and uh, within two minutes of coming on, you've got the ball in the back of the net again. You've got a knack for doing that and what a strike. Yeah, look, it's just, it's, every time I get on the pitch, I just want to try and help the team, try and score goals. There's probably times in the second half where I could have found someone and we could have probably gone on a, on a dangerous attack. But yeah, when I, when I knew I've got that space in front of me, the only thing in my mind is to shoot. And yeah, look, it went in. Um, we've come through a, a horrible week. Four or five of the lads going home on the on the Thursday. Um, so if you take all that, I think uh, the point is is good. You, you look at that, and obviously the players that we used off the bench, there was, there was strength there. We keep saying it all season, but we're back to that situation where players can come on and change the game. Yeah, look, we've got a, we've got a starting eleven who who are very strong. Uh, they could probably start in any team in the league, and I think the bench is. Is, is just as strong. Um, I don't think any any one of our bench wouldn't be disappointed to to start. So yeah, when we've got that coming on, yeah, we, I think we're good. Must be just the one disappointment was that you couldn't get that second goal between you because the, the chances were there. You hit the woodwork a mm -hmm. few times. Yeah, I think at times it was it was looking like that crew game where it just wasn't going to go in. I even thought that my strike hitting both posts. I thought, is it going to be that? Is it going to be that day? But luckily, it rolled in and. Yeah, look, we, we take the point and we'll, we'll move on. What about the Stevenage fans? Superb this afternoon. Yeah, they're, they're brilliant, um, brilliant today. Uh, it really do, it really really does help the boys when you see that support behind the goal, especially kicking into that second half, really lifts the team. Um, yeah, if they can keep doing that for the rest of the season and, and we can all be jumping around at the end. You've got a habit, haven't you? The goals you're scoring are in front of the Stevenage fans. Mm -hmm. It must be nice celebrating with them. Yeah, of course. Look, I've had some great memories this year already. Uh, scoring in front of the fans, um, but I only want one one memory, and that's at the end of the year, and we just keep going for that, really. And it's another couple of steps closer to what you want to achieve. Exactly, we've got eight games left, and they're, they're, every single one of them are massive. We're going to need everyone, everyone together, and uh, yeah, just go from there. Well done today, Jim. Cheers, mate.